Hello students, this is just a quick preview of what you can get with Noodle Tools. So after you make your account and, and you share your new project with your teacher, let me just show you what's possible. So I have a project that I've titled Literacy, it's right here. And so it's, it's the open project. If I press sources, you can see that I have already compiled three sources. And so once they are all typed up in here, to make my work cited, all I have to do is press print, and then I can print to Google Docs if I want. Then I wait, and it's gonna make my work cited for me. Kind of like EasyBib for those of you who have already used uh, EasyBib. Well, that's happening. Actually, looks like it's coming right now. So here's my work cited. It's done because I entered in the information while I was doing my research. That's it. Um, so you have sources. And then the other thing that is really cool about this resource is when you go to make note cards, here's your note cards. So when you take notes on whatever source that you do, this is what it looks like. So you have little note cards that you can you can move around, you can stack, you can hover over them and get a little information about what you wrote. You can make an outline of your notes to print out or make on a Google Doc so that you have your paper pretty much done. And so here's what a source card looks like if I press edit. I have a direct quotation from my source. I have my paraphrase right here or summary and then my own ideas about it and it's linked to the source card. So I chose the source that I used and I also put the web address of the source I used. So when you make a new note card, you just press new, you um, title whatever your source card's about. And let's say this one's about student readers. And then you select the source, which you've already typed in there. Let's say it was for this book here. You can copy the text, just a direct quotation. Here's where you put it in your own words, and then you do your original thinking. So, and then you press save and close, and you have a new card that you can put with your other ones. And you can make a pile and so on. So that's the reason we're doing this, because it actually, once you get the hang of it, will make your research much easier. I'm going to delete this practice one so it doesn't mess up my research. And that's what you have to look forward to right now after we set up our account. Thanks for watching.